you and Greg got no bumping today. What's going on? Like this stuff. You will be ready for whatever your, your life is going to bring you. So just, it's fine. I need you to come on. As, yeah, cool. <laughs> so go, like, let us know what's going on. Anyway, hi guys. Yes, Ingrid, and welcome back to my channel. Before I say anything else, I just want to wish you every single one of you Happy New Year! We're in 2017 and that's officially my first video with this background in 2017 and if you haven't catched the previous one, it was a book, a wedding inspiration lookbook and yeah, so basically that's my first video, me sitting here and talking to you guys. 2017 so I hope you guys um are ready for this here and um, you guys are ready for this here and ready to smash those goals get those coins I don't know do whatever you pray for or you wish for yeah so before I start with the video I just want to say that YouTube has changed their whole again the way you receive notification for videos so I think on the top right if it's not left i think the top right you will see a clock there you have to click on that and then um i think select um set the notification so every time i send i post a video you will be able to get the notification because i noticed that my video haven't got my video haven't got enough view compared to before i don't know that i think that's why i have a couple of friends telling me that they haven't received a couple of uh, subscribers telling me that they don't receive any notification when i put the video when i a video up so i just hope that's gonna help everyone else so this video is gonna be about i think something that really affect me or was really a big part of my life in 2017 2016 my bad and it's dealing with depression in um during august and and july mainly in july to august i was going through some really rough time and I think I definitely think that I was I was in the darkest like I have never been to the place I never been to this place of my life so I feel like I was in the darkest place of my whole life and then I was going to really a really big depression I was feeling like I want to give up on life like I want I want I want to end my life like that's how I was literally feeling like so basically that was a time that I needed to make choices about my career plan, to make choices about my future and to be sure of what I truly want of or what I um which part of uh, which pattern I want to follow and be sure that I stick to that and not change again. So it that it that was not even like enough and also seeing what I've put through that was like a part and also seeing what I've put so much effort on my YouTube I think I was I was in here and, and half already been in YouTube and I was not getting the view or the follow or whatsoever I was expecting I was thinking that why am I putting so much work in this I'm not seeing any result and then so all of this was going through my mind um, at that time I was still in the UK I was like then if I drop everything to follow this YouTube passion fashion and um, fitness and um, blogging and I don't get to I don't I don't have the result or the I, I don't I don't have the result that I'm expecting and how I'm gonna feel or uh, is it gonna be the right child for me at that point so I was just thinking um I was I was basically spending my whole day and my whole time crying I was spending my whole night on my whole day quiet and bed. I was not doing anything. I was not going out. I was not saying no. I was just and people around me, especially people from my Snapchat, noticed that I was not feeling well. Like my subscriber noticed I was not feeling well, even though I was not saying anything. Like you guys know who I am. I'm really out loud, crazy, and I'll go on my Snapchat. You guys know how I am. So when I'm not like that, you guys. What's up with you and Greg? You're not popping today. What's going on? Like, go, like, 
let us know what's going we are here for you so that's kind of what I was um I was going to I'm gonna tell you this if I have anyone that's going through the same thing if it's depression because of a, a boss a, a if it's depression because of work or not getting good results in school or a ex-boyfriend or a boyfriend is giving you some kind of headache or I don't even know just tell yourself that this is this this is like um this is a pattern I have to take throughout my life to get to where I want to be so this is not my final destination this is just a situation that's going to make me grow to what God has next for me because I truly think that if I haven't gone through that one month let me tell you this, I was in one month one month deep depression through that one month of depression of not knowing where I'm going of that feeling of one you want to end your life you are not satisfied with everything you are doing I would not be where I am right now I would not have this strong and um, I would not have this strong de determination I have right now and then I will advise you if you are going through the same thing and you feel like it's never going to end it's going to end let me tell you it's going to end and trust me for sure you're going to get out of that stronger than ever let me tell you this. you feel like you can conquer the whole world like literally it's okay it's okay to feel that way it's okay to have that feeling of unsatisfaction of why 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 this is not going the way i want it's okay to have that feeling it's okay to cry it's okay to break down it's okay to do whatever make you feel like i am not okay with my life right now but then at a certain point you will have to stand up you have to start making choices you have to start making big moves because in order also to get results it's something i say you have to put work I will tell you it's unfair to sit down and cry about a situation and then you don't try to change this the same situation if this, get, this makes some kind of sense and also I will tell you this surround yourself with good friends let me tell you this friendship if it's not good from if it's not if it's not built from strong base if you guys don't have a strong foundation together you are going to you are, you are not going to go get anywhere like during that time my friend they drop let me tell you, they drop everything for me when i say this i'm not saying this because i want to say this because of youtube you no know, or because i want to make people i want to make you feel like i have good fun no during that time i'm saying this and god knows my friend drop every single thing for me let me tell you this they were messaging me every single day they were coming to my house every single i have my friend you got my friend cleo my friend in the uk was my like my close friend that knew everything about me was cleo Rohel, and Juan. they were those three they literally i'm not saying this because i want to impress you guys they drop everything for me. Cleo left London. She came in Coventry to make sure I was alright. To be a one me. Mohel was she was even in Coventry. You guys know her. She was the one taking my picture and some of my videos. She was messaging me every day, coming in my house. Everything I think that and if you guys remember, I went that time in Lagos. I went in. Scotland and Edinburgh with her that was just a way for her to change my mind because I was not really I didn't want to go to that trip because I was like I just want to see my home and cry about my whole life that's how actually I was feeling and my friend did make sure that they put this smile in my face every single day every single day they I don't even have a word to express my gratitude toward them but I know that that's the definition of friendship. People that you know that when you're in your lowest point of your life, like you feel like you want to end your life, like I was feeling, I'm going to be there for you. Like I'm going to try.
try to make sure you feel all right so if you're going through something really rough right now let me tell you this it's just a situation it's not the end of your life just a situation that God is putting you through to make sure that you're going to be ready for what is next you have to go through it to be able to have fun what is coming next and also surround so yourself with people that you know that they have your back not a 50 percent not even a 100 percent a 100 percent and above like above 100 percent you know that no matter what happened they're gonna stick with you they're gonna make sure you're all right and also do something about it do something about that situation that's making you feel like you're not good enough you're gonna you're never gonna make it or you don't have enough money do something about it like change make some moves make some change that's gonna help you to move from that stage that you feel like okay I'm not satisfied with this thing whatever is going with whatever is going um, on in my life right now why can I do to move from there to a better to a better place if you say I don't know um, you're not getting good results in school try to understand why you're not getting good results in school if you're, you're doing YouTube like me and you feel like oh you're not popping like you want you or that video is not going it's not doing well as you wish do something about it go I don't know see try to do collaboration with other youtuber do something about it if you say boyfriend or I don't know a ex or a, 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 a I don't know whoever ex is signing, I don't know whoever is just telling you. Do something about it. Take him out of your life. If you say you, you, you don't have a good relationship with your friend and he's writing you, take her out of your life and keep going. Depression, I feel like depression is something that I know is bad and can make you feel like killing your own self. But it's also a situation that opened your eyes that make you realize that okay oh my dog is playing sorry my dog is playing right now that make you realize that i'm not okay with this i'm not satisfied with this and i need to i need to do something about it and i remember when i was oh my god my youtube is not doing well i want to do this i want to drop whatever i was i was telling you man about science i want to drop human about Whose phone is that? So I was not happy anymore with my course. I wanted to change and sort of something else. I want, so I was not happy with my course. I wanted to, to change and do what, I, what I'm doing right now. And I, I was saying that I was not getting, I was not getting the result or the view or whatever. The, I don't know. I was not getting the result I wanted in a year and a half on YouTube and a two year in blogging. I was not getting those results. Like, what am I doing wrong? Like I want to do, I want to leave this um, human bias as I'm studying right now for this. But I'm not getting any result. What I'm doing wrong? That's when most of you guys notice I was guesses in a lot of Snapchat. Like I did a lot of Snapchat account to promote myself, and I started changing the way I was taking my picture, the way I was editing my picture, the way I was doing this and that. So that's kind of when my youtube and my instagram start popping a little bit more because so i'm doing this wrong and that wrong okay so what can i do to get to to have um better result on this and that that's literally what you have to do and trust me it's okay what you're feeling right now it's totally okay if you're going through a rough time it's okay it's Totally, if you are gonna be so fine after, let me tell you, you are gonna get out of that, my sister. You will be ready for whatever your your life is gonna bring you. So just, it's fine. And you're a come on. As, yeah, cool. <laughs> so anyway, guys, I have been at the end of the video. So thank you so much for watching. Don't forget be a diva don't forget be a diva share love around you be kind with people share love around you and i will all catch you guys on the next one